Hey folks, uh, we're out here on Sunday afternoon, uh, April 4th maybe? Anyway, we're gonna plant potatoes and we're gonna do it in containers and I figured out that I'm gonna put uh, two uh, seed potatoes per container. I think these are like, uh, let's see. I think these are seven gallons. I'm not sure, but one interesting thing, they're from a company, Nursery Supplies, out of Chambersburg, Pennsylvania. And I, I have family history there. In fact, I went to college in Shippensburg University, so right down the, right down 81. So interesting. Anyway, I need 15, uh, actually total of 30 to plant the potatoes. So what I'm going to do first is put a shovel full in the bottom just for drainage and then I'll take them over here to the compost pile go ahead and fill them up about halfway I'll put the potatoes in at that point some fertilizer and what I'm gonna do is I'll put maybe a half a solo cup of 1010. About that. And then again, this is the first one. So uh, let me just put these in first. That might be too much. That should be good feed for them. And just cover them up. We'll see how this works. And I'll, uh, I have enough there to, for another shovel full once they start to sprout. And I'll put them over here. As you can see, I'm cleaning up a lot, <laughs> trying to get things cleaned up. I'll put them here and then I'll put a deer fence all the way around so that they're protected. Okay. Got them laid out. I didn't have enough of the seven gallons, so I have some of these three gallons that I'm going to have to use. Um, that's okay. I'll double. I'll double up on them. Probably put the smaller potatoes. But that's yeah. That's it. That's all the. That's going to be a lot of potatoes. Hopefully. All right. So I'll go ahead and fill up the, uh, the wood chips.
Okay, I think that's good. When they start popping up a little, I'll put more dirt on them. Okay, the last thing I need to do is uh, just make sure they're watered. And uh, when they're this close together, that'll be an easy task. So, yeah, again, once they start popping up, I'll probably put some mulch on top. But yeah, looking forward to seeing better results in containers this year than I had in the ground. Cause I didn't water at all when they were in the ground and they, it was a lot uh, less than stellar harvest. Okay, I still have a lot to clean up. You can see I'm trying to get organized here. So I'll keep trying to get cleaned up and uh, keep you posted. I have uh, two trailer loads of manure compost that's on order hopefully before april 15th so that i can get these beds filled up again and start planting but i have seeds started in the garage Okay, they're all watered. So now they just need to grow. Got this really nice uh, farm and ranch hose from Tractor Supply. So really nice one. Works well. Okay. I cleaned up quite a bit and I think I'm done for the day. <sighs> um, really hoping that the containers work out well uh, with the potatoes. Um, I tried in ground last year and I didn't water them, uh, just let nature take care of it and that didn't work. This time I'm using seven, mainly seven gallon buckets with uh, fertilizer and uh, the uh, manure compost and I th think that'll get me some good harvest so I'll keep you updated on that. <laughs> 